mic on. Okay, so let's get back to this. So I just, uh, right now I got some chicken preparing for later on. Um, I'm at the, this place again now. Uh, basically it looked like I'm on the verge of recruiting somebody to my crew. So I am trying to persuade her to join my team. She's looking for 6,000 credits. She, 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 she out of order. So let's see if we, if we can persuade her. Okay. so let's see so this reminds me of a joke I heard the other day I know there's a way the way you go pay past this uh, <laughs> okay that's pretty good let's see make sure sorry but uh, I can't that's as low as I'll go if you don't like it look for someone else oh I fucked it up then you're not hiring me it's simple math. We have the tech Damn it! Instantly I missed out! Across the universe. You'd think someone would have invented a way to keep rocks out If of you're place. hiring, I could really use the work. Astrodynamics. Stake me aboard your ship and I'll cut down on your grav jump calculation time and fuel usage. I think you'll agree my rate is fair. Excellent. Where to? I paid for her, guys. Only because she... Look, I... <laughs> Alright, so... Confirm. So, Astro... Okay, so let's see. So this is her assigned. Did I just assign her? So let me let me understand what I'm looking at. Okay, only got one ship. Current outpost. There's no outpost right now. Okay, so this is her assign. A. Confirm. So she already assigned. So I guess I go back out. I'm on my way. Oh shit. This is murder. <sighs> You're on your own. Who's this guy? Don't be stupid. Stop now. Huh? Stop right there. You see security. <sighs> Smart move. Now come along with us. We'll take any contraband and stolen property and you'll be free to go. Uh, the controls are kind of uh, janky. Don't want to catch yourself with a loose grip on your equipment for one of those parts. I sure hope this hearing loss isn't permanent. That servant drinks here for over 40 years. Few places can offer that kind of stability. So I got I got to take my time hey, and uh, think before I push buttons. Crippling depression. Uh, am I glad I got this job instead of mining some dead rock out in the middle Mars of nowhere? Mars isn't for everybody. Yes? Excuse me. Going to have to lug cargo across half the universe to pay for this cleaning. Pilot. Take care of your shit. Could end up costing you otherwise. <laughs> People always ask me what I think about the way. I'm 
we looking at? What am I looking at? You know if you need something. Oh, hello there. Uh, were you standing there long? Oh my! Oh, I completely forgot. Yes, of course. We have an amazing pamphlet called Top of the List, which is scientifically proven to work 90% of the time. Though I'm afraid there's a small fee to cover printing expenses. But your commission will more than make up for that, I can assure you. Wabam! <laughs> there you go. Stop it, you. <laughs> Not while I'm on the clock, anyway. No, I'm... I'm always on the clock. Thanks anyway, though. You're too kind. Oh, well, I guess I'm a dreamer. Always have been. My head in the nebula, as my dad would say. But I'm, I'm not cut out for the independent life. Not really. This is also... I want to be a part of all this. So here I am, helping people achieve their dreams. Doing my part to make the universe a better place. Right now, I'm doing this as a recording. Maybe with a smidge of living vicariously through the people I meet doing this. Like yourself. I like to imagine I've somehow become a, a small part of your adventures. I'm sure you're very busy doing more important things. Oh, sure, certainly. Bring me suitable planetary data scans for planets and moons that have O2 atmospheres and signs of life, and I'll pay you appropriately. Cool. The more habitable, the more I'll pay you for them. And you'll earn an immediate commission for anyone you sign up to the list. No need to return to me, we'll send the credits directly. Keep your ears open for people who sound like they need a change of pace or a fresh start. Bars are usually good places to overhear people complaining about things. Oh, I do. <laughs> That's why I hang out in them. <laughs> so no for share. Careful out there. Let's go back. Music exchange is a great place to buy your weapons. Pardon? Okay. Thought we'd struck oil. Turned huh? Out it was just not a deep water deposit. Upstairs? That would have been wild. Nothing. Why does it do that? You know what? So much current upstairs. Oh, it should be good now. Huh? Yeah? Re I'm recording. Yeah, I, I, I streamed earlier. I'm just recording it. Uh, and it crashed. Yeah. Alright. Alright. Can you get me a webcam? You want a webcam? Yeah. I have the ring light, no webcam, no camera. Uh, I'll see. This laugh ain't easy, but... 
What a day, huh? Going to have to let the cargo cross half the uh, universe what? to pay for this okay. cleaning. Yes? Pardon. Hey. I heard they found an Can you believe people used to think the nearby mountain was a face on the surface of Mars? Ridiculous, huh? Doesn't look anything like one. Before you... Hey there. Sidonia's not so bad. Honest work, good pay. I can't complain. As it's... Whew, what a long day. Just passing through, or here to stay? Uh, sometimes it feels like the UC forgets we're out here. But there'd be no UC if it hadn't been for Mars. How it goes? I swear that warning collapses. I'm telling you, we shouldn't be able to pull our guns or hit anybody. I don't know why they have us do that. I'm just looking around, see what's out here. Mars isn't for everybody. The mine. You to Sidonia? Hope you like sands. Being a miner is dreary. Being a mining executive is just weak. I lived a pretty quiet life to start, but the quieter things got, the more noise I made. Got into trouble, did the whole teenage rebellion to her, that sort of thing. <laughs> Dad used to say I was made reckless by boredom, but I think he deserves some of the credit. I came to do a little good old-fashioned soul-searching. You'd think it'd be easy to find, given it's my soul. <laughs> but, nope. Turns out it's a lot harder than it looks. See ya. Hello there. Most visitors can't wait to get off this rock. I have a pen pal in New Atlantis. We've never met in person, but she's still one of my best friends. Joy and Horus? I think they get along well enough. Sure, they argue, but that's a good thing. Disagreement's healthy. What good are your beliefs if you never have to defend them? Not to get all sappy, but I lost a son in the war. It's been 20 years but it still makes my brain a bit swirly thinking about it. Just never about to say goodbye, you know? That bugs me. So I come here to try and get peace. All right. Pardon me. Hey there. How's it? Never forget. There's nothing humanity can't accomplish through science and working hand in hand with one another. Why, hello there. What can I help you with? She Have sound you like come to oracle. seek assistance from the House of Enlightenment? Yes, the Enlightened serve as a community-centric institution, much like a traditional church, but without religious faith. Uh. For it's the community and faith in one another which is important, not adherence to a particular religious dogma. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah, leave it, don't touch it. We'll always be here if you need something, or just want to meet people. Actually, before you go, would you mind helping me out with something? I was debating with my dear friend Horace and would like an outside opinion. He believes that faith in a higher power is what inspires yeah. more people to be good. I say that Mike more off. people do good without any promise of divine reward or retribution. What do you think? Ah, 
That's an interesting perspective. Thank you. I guess when you get down to it, as long as people are good to each other, it doesn't matter what drives them to be good. I'll be sure to share that with Horace. Mike on. How's it going? It's not easy living in Sedonia. It's hard. There's <sighs> nothing like fresh air filters, am I right? There's nothing like seeing old soul coming through the big window in the morning. I wish there was more to do around here. Drinking gets old. Red and orange. Everything's red and orange as far as the eye can see. No time to chat. How are you? Faith in God is what brought us to the stars. Greetings, my child. Is there any assistance the Sanctum Universum can offer you? Very well. Please accept this gift in peace and prosperity. Blessed is the Lord, for he giveth to those less fortunate. May I assist you with anything else? Perhaps you would be kind enough to stay and hear more about our beloved Holy Creator. We can stay and listen if you like. I find theological discussions to be quite interesting. The Sanctum Universum will always be available to you, if you wish to know more. While I must disagree, I won't try to change your mind. You are welcome to go alone in your spiritual journey and make your own discoveries. But if you ever find yourself lost and need some guidance, please know that I am always available should you be interested in a different path. Faith be with you. I'm uh, just not into the religious stuff right now. <laughs> maybe, maybe my second one through. <laughs> training barracks. Cold, cramped, and <laughs> offensive. Take this. The city of Sidonia is proud to be able to tough it out on Mars. Tough it out anywhere. I don't care what anyone says. This is still a tough assignment. Always be ready for anything. Be careful. Sidonia can have a depressing effect on some people. Make sure to get yourself help before it becomes a problem. If you're going to use the elevators or stairs to reach the other levels, try to keep them clean. I hate filing litter reports. Hi, welcome to Jane's. Sidonia's only 100% independent one-stop shop. I apologize if I'm a little distracted. I'm currently dealing with a little issue, but please let me know if there's anything I can get for you. You have no idea. Every time I feel like I'm getting ahead, something happens to knock me back down. But unless you're some sort of merc, I'm not sure you can help. See, I saved up to get a new ship and hire a pilot. He was supposed to help run deliveries and bring in all sorts of new goods, but he went missing. I can't find anyone willing to track him down. I'm worried something bad has happened. I'm not sure. I'm hoping it's something simple, like he ran out of fuel. 
It's an older ship and it may have had a minor leak. But I know there's a problem with pirates out there. This was Eric's first real piloting job and I'm worried they could tell he was easy pickings or something. <laughs> could just be my overactive imagination. Sound like a lot of females. Yes, of course. I mean, I don't have a lot, but it's worth it. If you find the ship, I'll definitely be able to pay. I'll try to compensate you as best I can when you bring back Eric and my ship. It's a cargo runner called the Berry Mule. The last signal I got from him was out near Triton. It's a starting place, at least. And try to bring them both back in one piece. Gonna find my ship, right? Without going through official UC channels or our trade authority Okay, let me just pull up my stock and uh there it is. Take a look. Stock may be low, but my price. I like to sell stuff now. I start selling things. No. I think she got most of my stuff. See you around. Where are you? I'm broke at the joke. Where'd you go? Boris is good people, but I prefer Joy's line of thinking. Hey, I need you to listen to me. What happened? Members of Constellation are held to the highest regard, yet you persist on making poor decisions that reflect badly upon us. Huh. Because you're bending over backwards to help me right now, I'll stick by your side. But know that I don't approve of this behavior one bit. Uh, I know what you mean. Okay, so hey. We need to talk. Okay. Want to see what I'm carrying? You carrying all my stuff, woman. All right, let's get all this stuff back in my inventory. Go away, will you? I can't imagine what Eric's going through right now. It's funny. I hope he's okay. I feel like I'm a bit in over my head. Sure thing. Take a look.
negotiating with the FC. Good luck out there. Watch out for the robots, they're surprisingly sneaky. Where are you going? Hey, this time. You're gonna get me in trouble. Hello. Private drinking establishment, vets only. Not with any unit I know. Think I'll keep those drinks for the real soldiers. Now buzz off. No. Oh, uh, the place, the place feels alive. That's yeah. Uh... Horace and I may disagree on matters of faith, but we both try to do what we can to help those who feel lost. That's such an important thing. Do you ever get songs stuck in your head? Sometimes I have to make up my own songs just to get rid of them. Hi, I'm Renee, and I'm so bored. My mom and dad say not to talk to people I don't know, so I thought maybe I could talk to you and then I know you and I won't be so bored. Not sure exactly what you mean by that, but trust me, I've thought about this lots and it should be okay. Besides, now we're already talking and it's too late not to. Anyway, what do you want to talk about? I get it, man. Bye. These are supposed to be luxurious condominiums. <laughs> if you ask me, I find them to be rather underwhelming. I wish my mom weren't so sad all the time. Before I go, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> at least I, now, now that I've found a place, let's see what else is here. Can't, can't take shit here, boy. like it more than I do here. I'm Taye. I live here in the condos. Sorry. I don't, I don't usually talk to strangers and Taya. I don't know. I guess I'm thinking about lots of different things right now. 
I don't really know what to say. Yeah. I'm just worried about my mom. She gets sad all the time, and I just want to help her. She's been that way since my dad died. Only, she doesn't like me talking about other people. So, I probably shouldn't. But you know what? Maybe you should talk to her? She says she doesn't get to talk to too many other adults much. Maybe talking to her would help? I don't know. It's worth a shot, though. Right? Nah. There's no school in Sidonia. My mom says it's because everything's so packed together, there's no room for it. But also, there's almost no kids here either, so it doesn't make sense to have one. Instead, we learn remotely. It's cool, I guess, but it'd be cooler if I got to hang out with more kids my age. Like, my friend Renee is fun to hang out with and all, but I think she probably feels the same way. Having a real school would be nice. I don't know. I guess we just make up some games. Usually I just hang out and talk with Renee since she's close to how old I am. Sometimes we go to the community center and they have stuff to do there. Like crafts, movies, music, and other activities. But except not when the adults are having a meeting. Well, a game like this is Renee hard to stream. Sad so much dialogue. Seems so sad in them. But I guess people out there that they like to sit down. He says there's something to do with drinking, and like, I've never gotten sad after drinking water, so I don't know what's going on. Ah. Uh. See so you around. Thanks for the cobble, brother. Oh, wrong way. Do you have business with Governor Hurst? I see. Well, luckily, Governor Hurst enjoys visitors, and his schedule is fairly empty at the moment. I see no problem with it. Take care now. Try again, let me see. Hello? Do you have business with Governor Hurst? Oh my, in that case, please go right ahead. He's not busy at the moment. You're very welcome. Ah, hello. Welcome. I don't usually have time to speak with random people off the street, but I'd be happy to help if it's something quick. What can I do for you? Hmm. I can answer your general questions about Sidonia, but nothing venturing into politics. Sorry, but it's my strict policy that I only speak with select members of the press and major political donors who are serious about making changes 
for the future prosperity of Mars. Kind of in the middle of something here. Use that word around here. I do take donations, however. I'm glad you understand. You never know who's out to write a hit piece or take advantage of someone in my position. Of course, if you just want to chat about what makes Sidonia great, I am happy to oblige. Well, I've been appointed governor, what, going on 20 years now, I believe. Every day, I am passionate about serving the hard-working people of Mars. I look out for their interests, I support their prosperity, and in return, they help make the United Colonies a shining beacon of hope for humanity. Mm -hmm. If you ask me, there's nothing better than that. I think the next time we're gonna play Sedonia it again. Is not much of a tourist destination. I'm not gonna use a webcam. Unless you're interested in humanity's first major colony outside of Earth. But if you're not here for work and you're looking to kill some time, I'm uh, told the Martian surface is great for hiking. Beautiful scenery. Assuming you like shades of red. If you're looking to kick back after that and experience Martian nightlife, the Broken Spear is as good a local watering hole as any. You mean besides being the most important city of industry to our proliferation across the galaxy? Well, this is the home of Demo Star Yards, which perfected grav drive technology and made honest to goodness space travel truly possible. And to this day, our mines and manufacturing are instrumental in delivering resources used throughout the United Colonies. We may not outshine fancier cities like New Atlantis on its surface. But without Sidonia, there would be no United Colonies. Considering I don't really know you, I'm not sure how to answer that. But Sidonia is a beacon of industry. There's plenty of work to go around. If you have mining experience, you may wish to check with whoever the current Deimos mining director is. Or maybe check with the Deimos Staryard corporate office. If those aren't your speed, then there are a number of local businesses that are always looking for help. Caution. Sorry, we have to cut this conversation short. Imminent. Be advised to secure loose articles and find stable ground or remain seated. In There's no harder working city than Sidonia. In five. Yo, hey, three, what's up? Two, you looking to do some shopping here at the Trade Authority? I'm Minaki. Feel free to ask me anything, and I'll do my best to help you out. Particle detonation. See you around. It is now safe to resume normal activity. If you're here to buy or sell, you might want to talk to Octai. I'm busy. Here's an idea. Why don't you shout that louder so everyone at UC Security hears? <sighs> Either show me what you're trying to unload or get the hell out of here. Whoa, way too hot for me. That stuff is nothing but bad news. Why don't you take your shipment and try somewhere else? The Trade Authority turning away contraband. Now I've seen everything. No, they're right. What they didn't tell you is that I have a self-preservation streak a kilometer wide. Of course, if there's a finder's fee you're offering, I might, well, bend the rules a little bit.
You must be new at this game, love, so I'm gonna let that one slide. In our business, nothing gets done until money is exchanged, even if that means leaving a credit on each and every rung of the ladder as you climb your way up. Sure, go ahead. You shoot me, and the TA will have bounty hunters on your ass before you even get back to the spaceport. Listen, love, I've heard it all. Threats bounce right off, so either cough up the finder's fee or try and sell that shipment on your own. A little short on cash there? I guess you'll have to look somewhere else for help. Or come back with the finder's fee. It's you and me from here out. My contact is in Vanguard recruiting, so expect a sales pitch when you need him. Yeah, whatever. We got lots of stuff. Just that, hey, you looking for anything in particular? Cool. That's what we do here. Yo, stay good out there. You bring me that finder's fee? Or are you here to waste my time again? You know, it's funny. Suddenly, I do remember someone who might be able to unload that stuff for you. Well, well. It appears she suddenly remembers everything. Hmm, how nice. There's a buddy of mine who runs with the Crimson Fleet. Goes by the name Adler Kemp. If he isn't passed out, you can find him killing the rest of his brain cells at the Broken Spear. Oh, and uh, it's been a pleasure doing business with you. Whatever. I heard they've found another new. Freshwater depositing one of the mines. So much better than paying those ridiculous import prices. Let's put this over. Like you the fridge. Oh. Mm. Stop recording.